Hey everyone, ocean conservation and marine life expert Jacqueline Friedlander here, and today we are going to learn about the real animals behind the characters Bloat, Deb, Jacques, and Gurgle from Finding Nemo. All of these animals lived with gill, bubbles, and peach in the dentist's office fish tank in the movie. If you want more info on gill, bubbles, and peach, check out the video in the info section below. The character Bloat is a porcupine pufferfish. Other common names for these fish are blowfish, balloonfish, and globefish. As a defense mechanism, they swallow air and water and swell up to twice their size, making them inedible to predators with smaller mouths. Also, the spines on their bodies serve as another form of defense. A third defense is toxin. These little fish have neurotoxins in some of their internal organs that are 1,200 times more poisonous than cyanide, and these toxins are derived from their diet. Deb is a black and white humbug damselfish. These fish are found in tropical waters, and much like in the movie, they're considered to be good aquarium fish. They thrive in captivity and are extremely hardy. Since they're territorial, it's suggested that they be added to a tank after other fish have already had time to choose their territories. Jacques is a cleaner shrimp. Cleaner shrimp are extremely useful because they're scavengers who eat parasites and dead tissue off of reefs and fish. Some fish allow cleaner shrimp to go inside their mouths and gills to clean, and in return, they don't eat the shrimp. Gurgle is a royal gamma. Royal gammas eat zooplankton and crustaceans, and they're also considered to be cleaner fish eating dead skin cells off of other fish. They're found in reef environments as well as in aquarium trade, again, much like the fish tank in the dentist's office in the movie. So to review, Bloat is a porcupine pufferfish, Deb is a black and white humbug, Jacques is a cleaner shrimp, and Gurgle is a royal gamma. If you want weekly ocean and conservation information, click subscribe. See you next friends with Fins Friday. Thanks for watching.